Steve, FA Cup win today against Swindon Supermarine, 2-0 win. What do you make of the game? Yeah, tough, tough game again. Um, I think Swindon are a good football inside. Um, we had to be patient, we had to be resolute and we had to find ways. Um, I think spoke to the players at half-time about as the game goes longer, we'll have more and more chances as the game went on. Um, look, delighted for Tyreek, scored a great goal in the first half, like a little bit of ma magic. Um, it was the first time one of our tens received the ball in a pocket and drove at, drove at their defence and caused them all sorts of problems. Um, but a really, really good positive performance. I thought all over, we were resolute, we were hard to beat and um, every one of the players um, I'm delighted to give Leo a young lad um, make his FA Cup debut. Um, it's a big moment for him and the club. So um, look, it's on to the next. Um, but yeah, like I said to the players, if we keep clean sheets, got, got a chance of winning games, and um, we're doing that at the moment. But we've got to keep pushing, keep working hard, and uh, we're like it'll be another tough game Saturday. Like these are a good team. Like there's no no squares about it. They, they play some good football, and they're they're hard hard to beat. Tyreek's goal was a thing of beauty, wasn't it? How impressed have you been with him since he signed? Well, considering he missed a lot of last season, like I think he was out for six months with a broken leg. Um, he's come back in and he's got, you can see he's got fitter, stronger, and he's getting better every game. Like he's hes hes one of those that um, he's putting his hand up to say, look, uh, you might be rotating players, but don't rotate me. I like start me every game, um, and, and he, he's he's been he's been really good. He's a great character in the changing rooms. He he gives everything on the pitch, and when you when you hit seventy minute mark and you're absolutely out on your feet, it just shows the amount of work he does for the team. But I thought everyone was good today. I thought I thought Jay McCarthy it was his best game for us. I thought he was outstanding today, and like he will only get better for us. He's he's a really good player, and it just hasn't hasn't fell for him yet at the moment but you can see now like he, he's really dictating the games now and he, he's getting on the ball and he is some player and we're lucky to have him. Jack Hoey and Toby Holmes linking up for the second goal does that show just how important having a good squad is with players bringing off the bench? Yeah definitely I think um, I've always said to the players I've, I've just let's see, literally said to him now look there'll be more players coming in like I've got to keep pushing it I've got to keep pushing you lot as a group but also we've got to add a little bit more quality and like finish teams off and that's why I'm going to keep freshening it up and keep pushing the players we've got here and like they're a really good group and I've got to make sure the people I bring in here are the right type of people and the right type of characters but I know they will be um, but for me like we'll only get better like I, I, I firmly believe that as a group and as a as a um, as a club like the players we're bringing in are the right characters and they dig in even at the end there when Swindon had seven eight good chances they wanted that clean sheet and that just shows what um, it means to them to get that zero on their on their clean sheet bonus. So. <laughs> Back to uh, league action on the weekend. Should be another entertaining game. Yeah, it's going to be tough. Like, um, obviously we played them Saturday away. We know what we're going into. We know the surroundings. We know the way they play. They know the way we play. It's to play, play a team three times in a row is, is, is hard work and like they'll want to change a few things but um, like first goal first goal in games is massively important and um, if we can go up there and be hard to beat and get that first goal then um, obviously we're going to miss Tom because he's suspended but um, we've got a good enough squad to cope and um, hopefully there'll be some new faces well done tonight mate thank you